Slime in this off. Now this is guaranteed like to me the easiest way to clean mold. What you're gonna do is you're gonna take your fillet knife, hopefully sharp, and you just wanna cut up to the spine and you're gonna angle it up. So you're gonna get your knife in there and you're gonna angle it up towards the head. And this is gonna allow you to get more meat this way. You're gonna do the same thing here and this time. You're going all the way through. Next thing you're going to see is you're going to have a bunch of guts right here. All you want to do is you can either fling or pull those guts out with your thumb. Okay. Here. Rinse your flame knife off. And next thing you're going to do is you're going to cut off this bottom dorsal fin here because there's a plate here. So if you're doing it like I do it, you're not going to be able to cut through that so this just this little extra step helps you move overcome that problem pretty much but yeah there's a little plate here that gets in the way of stuff so the next thing you're gonna do is if you can see that spine there guys you're, all you're gonna do guys is you're gonna put your knife right up against the spine just like this and it's not recommended to cut towards your fingers but Go all the way up and ooh, get there. A nice, perfect little clay. Just rinse your hands off. Make sure your knife is clean. Come in. And hopefully I do a good flying job because I've been having issues. And then there you have it. Got this cleaned off. That was pretty much flayed up here. Next thing you're gonna do is make sure you don't have any scales on your knife and you just wanna find where that bone is. Just wanna get right up in there. And right up along that. Toss that out. I mean, this is a pretty small flake because it's a small mullet, but it's a pretty good little piece of meat here. Good enough to eat. I'm gonna go ahead and do the next side. Another pretty good on play. Clean your blade off. Line everything up. That one is your flint knife. Ooh. And toss this out. Same thing, you're going to do water hose. Come over here, find your spine. And taking the spine out is probably like where you lose the most meat because it's, it's a little bit of meat there, but I can still feel bone in it, so that's not something you want in your fish. And there you go. Got two nice plates. We'll rinse this off. Clean the other fish we got. I'll see you guys inside for how I'm gonna cook this.
Okay guys, so our NC comment issue, we ran out of Franks, so I'm reason Valentina. Valentina Mexican hot sauce or salsa picante. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Mexicone. Okay, never mind. Um so yeah, so that's what we're gonna be using um it smells it smells pretty good. And I got some Kentucky Fried Chicken Seasoned Flour. Got my oil heating up back here. Change that up a little bit. Yeah. Okay, guys, so I'm gonna just, hopefully I can do this without making too much of a mess. Start. See if I can find me some mini tongs in there to play around with this. Let's get her all lathered up in hot sauce. Put her down in nice flour here. Just take her from the flour and turn that down into a hair. Dang good if you ask me. A few moments later. Okay, yeah, so we're gonna try our first little slice here. Mm. Guys, this stuff is good. Mm. Yeah. If y'all like this video, I'd like you to hit that subscribe button, hit that like button, and turn on those notifications. See you next time.